Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. I just want to say, Happy Fatwood Friday. It's a beautiful day out here today. Look at the beautiful clouds, I don't know. I don't know if the camera is going to get it, video camera or not, but it's a beautiful fluffy clouds in the sky and a beautiful blue sky. Anyway, I got my fire pit going because I got to burn down some of the wood shavings when I'm turning on my lathe and I get piles and piles of it going all the way up to my eyeballs. And, uh, well, I got to kind of keep it clean around here. But, uh, anyway, I got a piece of a, a fin from some of the fat wood I found that I uh, cut and brought home the other day, several days ago. Anyway, I'm going to do a burn here. Let me get my stuff together. You know what? I'm going to have to stop the video camera and go find my knife. I didn't bring my knife out here. Hold on a minute. You going to come help me? This is Sylvester. Sylvester the cat. Hey, baby. What you doing? You gonna come help me? Come on. Come help me out now. I know you like flat, fat wood. I can't even talk right. Come here. Smell this. Does it smell good? It does? I thought so. Okay. Anyway. I got my knife out. Let's see. This is some beautiful, this is a beautiful fin. Look at that dark, dark area. That is beautiful. Um, we're going to cut some off of there. Now this fat wood here with the stumps. Or, or the logs that were laying on the ground. And that other that I got from that standing fatwood tree. Um, this has been marinating for years. And when, like I've said before, when you have something that marinates, you're talking about a burn. You better watch it. You better back up when you light that fire. Because it's going gonna, it's gonna, to uh, fly up in your face. This, this uh, fat wood doesn't play. Mmm. Smells good. Smells real good. Look at that. That is so dark. You know, I can get knots that are really dark and dense. And they burn well, but they just don't burn as well. There's a fat wood in the logs and stumps at least to me they don't uh maybe it's because i really haven't used in all honesty knots to burn except in my fire pit I'm trying to get this it's so flat it's kind of hard to get what i need But this is chock full of lighter, of fuel. This stuff will light your fire big time. And I'm not just saying that. I, I've tried it out. It, it really will light up quickly. So anyway, we're going to light it up. I got this little cup that I was burning the other day. I ought to put it in there, huh? I can stick it in there. I don't know. I'm not good at striking fires in cups, but we'll see. I'll see what I can do here. See if I can get it on there. I got a head sharpener 
you know, for your bushes and stuff. Anyway, I ground down the handle of it and I put it in one of my handles that I made. And uh, anyway, it's in there real good and sturdy. This thing will spark some sparks. There we go. Okay, let's see what we can do. Happy Fatwood Friday. And to the community, to the Fatwood community. Whoop, some of it fell out. Happy Fatwood Friday. This thing is so full. Okay. Whoop. Okay, there we go. Like right on up. I gotta be careful with it because it might dip on me. Ooh, there's one on the ground. Cheers. Cheers, everybody, to the Fatwood community. Keep the fire burning and keep wood turning. Man, I'm fixing to get burned if I don't watch it. It's gorgeous, gorgeous stuff. This is beautiful. I'm going. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to light some on the table to show you how quickly this lights up because this right here in the cup you can't tell but anyway that's beautiful Woo! look at that look at that dark black smoke bellowing out of it and all the resin dripping down look at that black resin beautiful stuff you can tell this stuff is rich We'll put it over here. Let it burn. Okay. Let's see if we can get some more off of this fin and burn on the table. How about that? I don't know. It's kind of hard to get. It's at a bad angle and it's tall. I can't hardly get it off. I know I gotta use a corner here. We'll do this. Yeah, this stuff will light your fire. I'm gonna show you how quickly this lights up. And you better back up. This is so old. No telling how old it is. And you know, fat wood, I don't know how many years it takes to form. I, I know it takes at least three to four years because I got some fat wood from a pine tree that got knocked down by Hurricane Michael. And it was only about uh, four years old. And, uh, and it had fat wood in it. But most of the other of it had uh, rotted away but it it still had its uh bark on there and stuff so it wasn't like it was old 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 fat wood like this this right here doesn't even have its bark on there anymore really it's just dried and shriveled up like skeleton bones and uh that's all you get it's just full of fat wood you can look at it and tell it's just full of it but this is some beautiful wood and it's heavy too it's not a light piece of wood you go pick up a piece of pine wood at lowe's or something yeah you're gonna you're gonna see the difference real quick like i need to get a good knife too So, anyway, I think we got enough of a pile. What do you think?
Okay, that's good. All right, here we go. All right, I wanna show you how quickly this stuff burns. Let's stick it down in here. Woo, you better back up. Man, that stuff, that, that flame is high too. That whole thing just, once it lit, that whole thing just lit up. That's how quickly this stuff fires up. This is some amazing fat wood right here. And that's what happens when you get marinated fat wood. It's just sitting there. You can tell the bugs have been trying to eat into it some and live in there. But it takes years and years for that to disappear. Look at how waxy it looks. So anyway, happy Fatwood Friday. And I hope you all have a wonderful day. Thank you for coming by my channel and visiting. And thank you for all my new subscribers. Bye-bye.